Hey everyone, Son of Beast and Terry Crews here. This is NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs 24 on EA Sports. Hello everyone, it's Terry Crews and I am here with Lightbulb. And this time, this is where Game 7 comes in. It's in between the Tampa Bay Lightning and the Carolina Hurricanes. The last one ever of round two. The winner moves on to the conference finals. And as of right now, this is it. Both teams are tied up with threes. We're looking to see who can take the win in game seven one last time. As you already seen, the Western Conference only has one for the Vancouver Canucks and the Golden Knights. These are the last ones over on that side, but we'll get to that later. But this is what the first game starts here in the Eastern Conference. This is the 3.30 game, so if you're tuning us right now, let's see who can take the win of this matchup. The last commentator of Game 7 of the Iron Kings and the Lightning I will have is Son of Beast, and he's also along with the other commentator with Silver Spoon and in center ice, I have his wood spoony for the for the centerized position to check out the results in between of the players' ex player status. And we'll see you all later for the post game show. Now, enjoy yourself for the first game of Game 7. It's Game 7 at Carolina. It's a win to get into the Eastern Conference Finals. I am here along with Silver Spoon and Switch Spoony. This is Center Ice for tonight's game. Do or die between the two teams as we are underway in PNC Arena for the NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports. Let's roll! The start of poop here for Tara Vinan after the puck lost by Braden Point. Now he goes it over to Ian Svechikov again to Burns. Burns gets to Tara Vinan. Tara Vinan right toward the right wing. Takes a big hit right to the wing. Point gets it over to Pagel. Pagel sidesteps it through right toward the center. In the zone, this one is off the pad and it goes right down to Slavin. Slavin now finding Burns in toward the center ice. Tara grabs that puck rebound. On his way in front, Spetschikov shot, stopped by Andre Vasilevsky. And now has a rollover again to Hagel, again to Point. Point with the shot, this one is right toward behind the net. And Burns grabs the puck. In a chain, gives again to Slavin, over to Tara Vinan. Hurricanes are on the attack. Two on one opportunity, that shot misses the target, right toward the wall, and it's back to Sherry. You know what I say now, because the Hurricanes are really like the nastier team, look at the critic. They have already been shelling it down at the motion of their drive. They beat the Flyers in the first round, but I have no impression of how this is going to happen. It might be a little bit of a difficult change here in round two, but hopefully on that one, I don't know what's going to keep on trouble. They're going to have to find their way out if they can get their food. Flyers up off the right toward the net. The Lightning were getting a group as Radish with the puck. Now Sketchy will have it over, give the pass off to Bunning. Bunning toward the left wing, try to have another answer. He just shoots it! Vizalevsky grabs a puck save. He will hold that puck here with only under 17 30 to go. Here's the tape for Victor Edmund. Hobbin is one of the better defensemen ever to tie all for this pressure ranging. That's why it's just called a stick em up ability to keep that puck out of here. And the better range is, is to keep that girl in tightness. It's a great way to have that puck steer and take it over in between. Here's the really shot, love saved by Krojeknov. He will stop that puck and get ready for the face off. Teams are set ready for the face off. No score between Tampa Bay and Carolina. Saul wins the faceoff. Sketchy now gives again to Jarvis. Jarvis lost the puck. Now it's back to Hedman. Martinuk loses one. Now it's back to Chaffee. Again to Isamel. Isamel now finds again to Sorelli. Sorelli right toward the right wing. Fires his shot. Big save by Kuchikov. 
Jarvis gives to Stahl. Stahl right toward the left wing. Trying to make his way in. Big collision takedown. Chaffee. Scrimmaging along in the inside of the slot. Near the slot is Isabel. Shot. Stop. Good take here by Kochikov. That's a little bit a little dangerous out there, playable. But it's not always easy when you keep that one coming down. Now they're set ready for the faceoff. Looking for a score to get a 1 0 lead in between. Wynn puts in for Slavin's team. As out of Hurricanes are grabbing another puck inbound to Drury. And here's Burns. He's has it over to get a Slavin. Off to Natchez. The pass over to Bunny. Bunny right toward the left wing. Give it over to Drury. Blow the save. It's off again. And now it's back to Furbrick. Scrub the pack of the save by Veselevsky. Sherry right toward the right wing. Has a big hit tumble take down. And oh boy, they're going to get attacker. And there is a penalty call. That's going to be on Slavin. Yeah, you don't like that call? You're going to get that one bumped out. That's going to take a lot of the defensemen players to get roughed up. They're never going to like that at all. That's called meaning the payback. And the win puts in for the Lightning. Dropping the man down for the Hurricanes, and they'll now have to set into the penalty box. It's not nice at all for Jacob Slavin to try to put up on someone else. And it's on Nick Paul already. You don't take the credit on this point, and you're going to get that one a lot of a kickful, crucial fighting of disrespectful between the Tampa Bay and Carolina. Nobody's going to like that one. And you're going to believe that you are doing something as bad, and it totally no one cares for it. Stop again by Veselevsky. Jury now finds again the sketchy. Natchez. Back to Burns. Fires it! No deflection is off and getting on the wall. Natchez shot. Big save by Veselevsky. Jury now has to go over again to Burns. Almost missed it! And Kucherov takes a puck out again. New single right toward the wing. In the dry spot. Bit sketchy with the puck on the back of the other way again to Burns. Burns over now to Bunning. Bunning right toward the right wing. Lost that one to Stefan, we'll have it back over. Now it's off to Cagle. Cagle, sliding it in. Aqua with the puck steal. Grabbing the puck back is Cagle. Watching the play inbound, losses that one, and Sebastian Aqua with the puck takeover. Take a big whip out of him, and this is stopped by Victor Hedman. Unbelievable. That's going to be a crash course in between of the Hurricane and Tampa Bay Lightning. I know, they're definitely trying to be top down. Don't let anyone take over you. So really couldn't hold on to the puck with the rebound to score. And it's back to Tara Vinen. With the rebounding puck. Close save by Veselevsky. 13.29 left to go in the first period. Still dead in the books. Zeros. Andre Veselevsky has one of his contortionists of his better of his taking of his wild side in between. He's better to take over his defenseman settling, but his game out can be a little bit of a hard way for his wild card team if he has a lot of saves to put him out after if there's a screen or an open look. He will have to try to get over this if he can kind of do it. And it's now back to Martin. What a Save on the pad by Veselevsky. Shoots it again. That's covered up by Veselevsky. And it's still tired, tired up. And it's now will be ready to get our face off in the lightning zone. So lots of time left in this period. Still haven't seen a score between the Tampa Bay or Carolina. And a win puts it in for the lightning. Mote with the puck with a two-on-one opportunity. Trying to cut it down. Shot! Wow, that was missed already. Great save by Kuchikov. Fair ball on the cut it down. Save puts it up. And he will hold it on. Just only 12.29 to go. Next faceoff comes in between Carolina or Tampa Bay. 
That's a bit of a win. He burns the shot. Big save on a play. That's not going to be easy enough to have a coach a crowd get that one with the goal. You know, better effort is not what they always seem to do. And I know that's a little bit of a hard and difficult strength. I'll see what they can do if they can try to keep on messing them up. Every single time, it doesn't happen what they always are expecting now, as you always wish. And a shot misses. And here's a look over Duck Eggman. Now here's another one to Barrett Bullock. Barrett Bullock trying to spin around. He has it over again to Eggman. Pass over to Riley, a shot. Goal for deflection, stepped out. Riley tries that one again. Moving in front, misses the shot. Learning back again. Spinning through, stopped by Kochakov. Now here's the question for this mascot. The name is, you know, Stormy the Pig. Why is that called? Well, it's because of what this happens here. They are really what they are noticing for. They gotta get this one through. And that's why the abundance of hog frogs in eastern North Carolina. They originally wanted to do the ice dogs, but that idea was scrapped. It was 86 immediately, and this time, they wanted to change it up. Hmm, I know the farms a lot of it. I don't know anything about that. But that seemed to be a little bit okay idea with Ice Hawks. But I like that name when calling Stormy because Stormy that bitch, and definitely the storm definitely did happen here. I always like to say that was a little close call for Coach Cup playing bound. Sebastian Argo has a third eye ability. He keeps it right in between the middle to have a C and I vision again between the guard tenders and the defenseman break away. Brayden Point is one of his better closing quarters in the balance. In the first and second through third period, this may be what their take is, and this one crashes near the crease on to have it in. Outside of finding out those two keeps on coming. It's going to be a crashing sight in in Carolina. Back to you. And here's Chatfield. He has it over again to Terravine. He moves it over to Orla. Back to Svechikov. Svechikov missed the shot. Brubix now has it over again to Chaffee. To the right wing, lost that one. Ah, uh, gives again to Svechikov. Hurricanes in the lightning zone. Off again to the right and shoots, it's blocked up. Lettelberg fighting again to Sorelli. Sorelli in the right wing. Chop that puck out of here. And Orlov right over on the other side of it. And he gets it over to Svechikov. Rolling in the middle. Shoots it again! Big save by Spezalevsky. Now it's off to Stamkos. Takes a big hit as Svechikov will have it up around the puck. And it's now back to Sernax. The Lightning are regaining the group back into the Kane zone. Off to Sorelli's shot. That was a big save by Kochikov. Skeggy over to Drury. Drury right turn to right wing. Over to Shy Storms! Michael Murray! First goal in game seven, now after more than 1-0. Don't take the risk of it for Michael Fanny. That has to be what they expected to play with. Well. Now let me see what's happening to them. That shot is pretty impressive when they all expected. And you can't do the mark out of it, but that comes in through. Just don't take a risk to make it do that now. Carolina starts ahead, one nothing on the scoreboard. That's Michael Blaine with another playoff goal in every game. Yes, true to be honest now that, that Michael Blaine is really taking all of his time and effort. After coming with the play against the Maple Leafs, he really has to turn out that this team is the bright fit for him. I always really like it when he they're playing really well. But don't take the bets out of them. They have no idea what's going on happen. But they're gonna keep this one out there, they gotta keep on moving. Glenn in right over to get a mote. Fires a shock, left saved by Kuchikov. 8.26 left to go in the first period, one owes the score.
Now the skull wins the faceoff as Burns keeps again to Jarvis. 820 left to go in that first period as he's trying to make his attack game. Veselevsky makes a glove save with 812 to go. Now that he's in pressure, what happens to the skull? You know, I've never seen what goes in like that. At all time, nobody has the right moment. The win puts it in for the Tampa Bay. Now he's another take. Barrett Bullock. Over again to Glendening. Glendening. Louis Brown's the puck. Shot safe. Puts up by Kochapov. Now here's the call for all the static about Sebastian Ajo. He is a Finnish professional ice hockey player and the alternate captain for the Carolina Hurricanes. He definitely has played it in Olon Karpati in the Finnish SM Liga. Ago made his professional debut in the Olon Karpatur's 2013-14 season, and it was drafted in the 45th overall pick in 2015, and his debut during his midway to 2016-17 season. It's what I always can definitely say for Sebastian Ago, not the one for the New York Islanders, but this one! From the Carolina Hurricanes for the Finnish off hockey player, I really have to say that he's really uh, that strong effort. And then playing it like that, I always notice that his career puts it in Finland. He's really like a professional to play his honest way. Have played for a long while then. I don't know what's going to happen, but that boy could be a great stop if I put you off. And that really is getting a lot of hard use of his skills. I know that Kuchikov is really firing this way. And it's, this is what happens now. Keep going when you do. The next face off coming in for Carolina or the Tampa Bay as this one 8 over 7. And now as the Lightning ties it up and a face off wins. Tara Vining trying to get it right into the group in the attacking run. And it's missed again. Peshke takes it over, now finding Skedgy. That bad play didn't really help. Havo shot pass saved by Vesilevsky. Now it's perfect back it over, the pass back to DeHaan. DeHaan's got it over across again the point. Point shot, big save on the play. Goes for it again. Another stop by the goaltender. Here's Spetchikov with 6.09 to go in the first period. Toward away, trying to get into it. And it's over to Teravainen, it's redirected right through the wall, and Kucherov has it over now to Hegel. Here comes Hegel on the full pressure. The breaking bound now gives again a Paul shot. This one's chopped up and back to Ago on the rebound. Here's the take, the pass over now, and he makes a swift on the wall in the center ice. Back to Dijon, again to Paul. Paul right toward the right wing. Lost the puck control. Carolina racing in towards the group. Stamkos takes the puck away. Chaffee trying to answer it in. Loses the effort. Now it's back to Stamkos. And Bunning takes the puck over. Back to Drury. Big hit on a slap down. Dijon takes it over. Now finding Burbix. And it's now Bunning back the other way. Spinning in control, Paul takes the effort with the puck steal. Bunning has it back again to Burns. Burns, cutting back, he scores! One goal for Carolina Gaines. They now extend it to O. It's easy to know for Brett Burns. He scores it really well. A big bet. They say that slapper, slapper, just got it through. Carolina up ahead, 2 0. Old win the Tampa Bay Lightning. Feels like they really want to die. I don't know what's going to happen. I'm sure the Lexington seem to be a great player. They look for the Panthers now. But I always wish them. I say it's a great congratulations to making to the finals for the first one. It's a back to back win going into the finals for the second time. Since they haven't won the Stanley Cup champions already, they still have zero. Well, I have no overtakes already because that is not my favorite team at all. But I don't care about what they do, but this is what that I always seen it before. Since season one, happened to be the postseason of it, 
between the Panthers and the Rangers. That's our NHL 22 of EA Sports. Yeah, they definitely did so. I mean, I don't know what's going to keep on coming, but I think they're going to have to like keep it on keep moving to get through. Here's Martin up after a broken up play here, and Slavin will have it over with under four minutes. Lost that puck, chopped up as Martin Oak with the rebound. Gives it over to Stahl. Stahl shot! Big stop here by Zalewski. 3 for 8 to go in the first period. Trying to have an answer in there to get right into the point. Narrow faceoff coming in for the Carolina or Tampa Bay. Point wins the faceoff, and Lilleberg will now clear the puck out of here. In the zone with the Cagle. Cagle. Off again, point, moves it around, big on the foul chopper. Racing toward his speed in the corner. Recovered by Martina, misses the target wide. Burns gives it again to Martina, back to stall shot. It's Lilbert with the puck takeaway. Jarvis back to Slavin, redirected in, big save. Martina fires it. That save! Unbelievable! There's a full pressure coming in for Carolina, and they're all over the place. Well, that's Storm Rampage. It looks like they're trying to attack someone. I think they're trying to, like, lead that Storm out of the zone. And they really wanted to keep on picking on the goaltender. They had no idea what's going on, but that is really what they are expecting it to keep on going. And another step made here by Veselevsky. And now Hedman will try to give it over again, back the air away. Deeps the puck around his own. And it's Chaffee. Cut him down. Save. Two in a row. That's stuff to get by Kochikov. Under two minutes remaining in the first period. So 2 0 game. Now they're off to do an error faceoff. This one's still going in. 2 0 of the game. Truly wins the faceoff and Burns is battling along the board. Taking over his Paul. Paul goes in again to Headman. Off to Reddish. Reddish shoots it. Well, to Chappie, this one stopped again by Special Coach of Paul. Off to Paul. Fires it. Misses wide off the deflection. Bunning gets again to Burns. Burns gets to Slavin. Off again in Aegis. Shoots it. Misses again. Now it's over to Paul. And it's passing, taking over. Going for three. And I guess one goes for the kick. Svechikov can't get the puck going. Off to Radius again to Stemkos. We're under a minute left to remain at first. Off the goal post. Slavin gives it over now again to Svechikov. Takes a big whiffle down on the board. And back to Barrett Bullet. Over to Glennonay. Glennonay. Towards again a Monte shot. Peschke takes the puck back. Streaking into the attacking zone. Flings the puck out. And Nago will have it over again to Snuchikov. Shot saved me by Veselevsky. Over now to Barrett Bullet. Barrett Bullet, time is wasting down. Shoots it, save! What a great block playing here by Monte. But this one stopped again. Yeah, you never know what's going to happen like that. But this one is having what they are expecting. And it's just going to take so much time and effort to get it done straight. There's the horn. We enter the intermission. And it's a 2-0 game. Hurricanes up ahead. Stay tuned. Second period coming up after this. Welcome back to the EA Sports of the Stanley Cup playoffs. We're about to start the second period. Play resumes and we are ready to get this thing underway back at PSC Arena. So glad you could join us. And for the start of the second period, we have a first period recap. I sent it over to you, Silver Spoon. I thought I did. Well, I mean, they always say the start of it puts it up for Tampa Bay Lightning. They're trying to get that goal right away. But it doesn't really happen most of all, because that hurricane starts it up big. A 2-0 score really got him in trouble. Right away in that, they really are trying to let somebody else get there through. Let's hope that the Tampa Bay Lightnings can try to find a way to tie this game up.
Looking to go over the airway for the face-off win between Canes and Lightning. Still, still a 2-0 score. Face-off lead for Ajo. Here's an error with the third binding. In the corner, trying to give over to an open man. Ajo for three and oh! Stop again by Wazilewski. Great screen effort, but this one doesn't take in for the current case to extend it. Now here's Victor Redman and point. Fires a shot! Big stop by Kochikov. Hagel gives again to Radish. And over to Kucherov, shot, big stop here by Kochikov. Just 18.42 to go. Oh, yeah, I can hear now. I can hear the fans cheering on. Well, this is what they always expected because that happens to Kochikov. Take a quick timing reaction in here, but that is not what's going to take in there. Bigger rebounds is just impossible. There's no way that you can try to like, defend it, but that is what they all do. they got to keep it going from here. As we look over on the other side, Nikita Kucherov is the ultimate of the, of the ultimate captain and a Russian professional ice hockey player from the winger. And this is what I do usually have to say it before. They have no other, other ability in between the Sebastianago and Nikita Kucherov. The better of this one has to be for regarding the best players in the world. He has won a Hart Memorial Trophy and the NHL's Most Valuable Player, MVP, and R. Ross Trophy as the league's leading scorer, and Ted Lindsay Orr, best voted for the fellow NHL player for the 2018-19 season. I know it happened. I always could say that Nikita, Nikita Kucherov had to be really taken over. You know, the other thing is, you just can't really get away with this one for the Kucherov. They really love it. But they all expected now that they need to be playing it for so long. The better reason is, no other questions of the hard feelings. We just gotta get that through. He's gonna take the Drury for three and oh, save again by Vasilevsky. Trying to give over to another player about an open look. Hedman with the covering pack, back again to Choppy. Choppy, nowhere to go as the puck's taken over. Bunny gives again to Drury. Here's an take. Shot stopped made by Vesilevsky. Nages finds Drury. Drury to Nages. Poked it out by Vesilevsky. Drury tries it over to get to Pesky. Chappie trying to give him over with an open group. Here's a Chappie uh, chance. And Martin takes it over. Back to Jarvis. Jarvis right toward the right way. Big collision takedown for Victor Hetman. Off again to Mote. Monte shot and he scores. Good takeover for Monte. They're now on the board 2-1. As you give it over to Monte, this is what definitely happened. That puck went sailing over the pad and it just went right toward the net. Good hustling amount, good takeover skill. That's what you gotta take with that first goal in the second period. Tampa Bay Lightning are trying to tie this up. Tyler Mote with his first goal in the NHL playoffs of the game. It's now a 2-1 game. And as of now, as uh, Tampa Bay Lightning wins the faceoff, here's Nick Furbitz. And Mote for two, misses the target. Great chance here for Furbitz, but no assist breaking in. And another shot stop made by Kochikov. A little bit tricky on that oopsie doodle here. And as you already know, Nikita Kucherov brought their team to a win twice with the NHL of the Lightning in 2020 and 2021 season. After playing against the Dallas Stars and playing against the Montreal Canadiens during the COVID-19. But this time, he holds a record for the most points of the Russian-born player. A single season that happened with the Blair franchise playoff records for most points, most goals, and most assists. Trying to get a catch over by Alex Ovechkin. I never say what they do. Nikita Kucherov is just how playing is. You do what you take, but it's not really what they all expect it now. They gotta get this one through. They never say that. I always say Nikita Kucherov is really like the best player of the NHL history. But that doesn't really happen with the air and need to do for another take. I gotta try to see what they can do if they can get that. And a save puts it up by Kuchikov. Be easy on that! 
because that good giraffe is trying to get their team to a tie and bustle. May not be what you want. Lightning are back in the offensive scoring, so now have a diagonal again to point. Here's Kucherov. Pass again to Furbix. Furbix rolling around the airway. Point. Shoots. Save. And it rolls it over. Furbix trying to get the bagel. Chop that puck out as the puck exits the zone. And here's Kucherov. No takedown here as Hegel picks the puck and rebound. Here's point. Oh, he didn't get the timing done. And he got him caught. In the take in between, still a 2 1 game, Carolina over Tampa Bay. And the win will put it in for the Lightning. Stops the shot made here by Kochikov. Oh, big kick! Sorelli! Nice takedown here! I can see what's going on in Sebastian now. He got a little bit of rough up already. He's feeling like he wants to rush out of here. I don't know what's happening. There's lots of time up in the spirit yet. Tampa Bay trailing by one with 14-19 to go. So Worley wins the face off. Good stop here by the goaltender. Spires it! Misses wide! Svechikov brought their puck out of the zone. Shoots it! Save again by Veselevsky. Now it rolls again ahead bin. Here's another one to Izumau. In the middle. Fires it! Save puts it in by Kochikov. Now Burns off to Slavin. Gives it over to Aho. Aho racing down towards the other way. Got a big hit on the Bruce. Yeah, but now finding Sorelli. Pass to Svechikov as this one gives it over to Slavin and back to Taravainen. Took a big hit for Hedman. Here's Victor Hedman. Sprinting his way right toward the in the net. Parabola. Got a name for the rebound. And save again by Kochikov. Oh, that was an unlucky take. But great stop here for the goaltender. Just can't lose it out. That's what they don't really take enough. That credit for Victor Redman, he got to knock him down. Face off win for the Lightning. Edmund shot with a pad saved again by Kuchikov. Now it's over to Barrett Bullet. Great fits a stop here as Kuchikov will cover the puck out. Here's the nickname to call for Steven Stamkos. They called it Stammer. Stammer that rocket in there, and they are really are making this with a better chance at ability to play on his own type of a game. Now, because he was been doing it for on his better behaving of this game, he was first selected in 2008 NHL entry draft, and then on his leading school scorer, 2010 and 2012. Two-time NHL second team all-star, 2011 to 2012, and it's been named seven NHL All-Star Games of the night. I really have no other idea how they could definitely do that, but I was really wondering, how did he ever do that? Better than any game for Stamkos? Make the drive out of it? Because that's what happened, he did the same thing as suspended as the back-to-back -back Stanley Cup Championships in 2020 and 21. And it was appearances in the finals in 2015 and 2022. I really think you expect now that, that the Lightnings are really doing well with their Stanley Cup. They always been knocking things out of here. And better chances, no other words, you got to play for real. Marino with the battling cup rebound. Here's Skedgy. The pass back to Stahl. Stahl making his way down to Bunning. Bunning passes over to Natchez. Natchez cutting bound. Rebound it again. Stopped by Veselevsky. Point over to Hegel. The Lightning are spinning their way across. Kucherov can't hold on with the puck as Skedgy takes it off to Natchez. On his way down. Stopped by Veselevsky. 
Just nearing the midway mark of the period in a second. They're trailing by one for the Lightning. Now they're off to do it again. Two ones to score. And then our face-off win for Nick Paul. On the Lightning side, getting over again to Hedman, finding Paul. Paul spinning his way down. Shoots it, and it's soft and deflected, and it goes right again to Stamkos. Stamkos to Paul. Over to Chappie, shot with a tie, stopped it again. Stamkos, he scores! Stammer gets his team to tie it up for two. I don't know what the captain does now. If that really helps him, they got it done. You know, great setup for Steven Stamkos made this one an early on the skating edge, the possibility for a one-time team, but that didn't really change it. That one just zipping through the goaltender, they've got a great eye comeback. Teams are tied up for two, and it's only coming down to a midway mark of the period. Face-off win for Paul as Reddy is just trying to get their group back in. Pass over. Samkos blocks that shot. Natchez trying to kick the puck out. Over to Slavin. Now he throws again to Bunning. And that big hit takes it over. Slavin trying to regroup. The deep pass again to Natchez. Lost the puck and now back to Reddish. Reddish gets to get the champion again to Samkos. Now here comes another one for two. Ball for a lead. This one stopped again by the, the by the blocker stop. And burns over to Akko. Off the headband. And Chappie now has again over to Stamkos. The deep pass to Glennon. Set up on a chain. It's been redirected. Back to Svechikov. Rolls it over to Terabinen. Another deep pass. Great set it in the way to Slavin. And it's over the Burns as he takes the tumble down. Terabina back to Slavin. And a shot blocked up. Rebound again. For no chance. Oh, stopped by Bezalevsky. Where it's trying to battle for the rebounding puck. Now it's Kevin with the airway. The turnoff to Parapulic. Again to Mote. Mote shoots. And another pass stops again by Kochikov. Kashki trying to give over to again to Svechikov. Wolves it in, fires a shot, big save. And for a lead, this one doesn't take in. Dion trying to battle that puck. Svechikov trying to keep that alive. Tara Minen, full pressure's on. Keeping the team alive. Ako, Seji, saved by Wazilewski. Paul trying to kick it out of here. Sebastian Ako trying to get out of there here. Hegel back to Kucherov. Over to Hegel. Hegel in toward the inbounding group. This one stop. Kucherov takes that puck stop. Under eight minutes to go in the second period. You know you can feel the energy in between the Lightning and the Hurricanes, but I'm saying that Hurricanes haven't really just scored at so many others since the tie chain is broken. Over the third or the second period, I don't know what's going to keep on happening. But I'm going to say it's what are they going to do if they can try to do without it? Let's hope there is a will or a chance. Clearing the puck doesn't take over. Not going to be shot saved again by Vasilevsky. Not going to be half by Skeggy. Vasilevsky shoots it. No deflection given here. Lilbert gives it to Rally. Back to Ismail. And now back to Chappie. Takes a smash kick. Orlock grabbing the puck and bound. Over to Fast. Pass right toward the right wing. Over to the pass. Shoots it safe, but puts it up again by the goaltender. Nose in. Takes it over again. Fast shot. And another stop by Mazalewski. Oh, he's been suing so well. I don't know what's going to keep on happening right now. You know, I'd say for Andre Mazalewski, that was keeps it pretty. Out of anybody, he's been like a king out there for the goaltender. Chatfield shot. Never stop made by the goaltender. Monte try to battle that puck. Near the blue line. Takes a big hit. No penalty called on Tampa Bay. And now Chatfield over again to Bunning. 
in the Lightning Zone. Pages over to Shai Scores! Michael Bunny rebounds the lead in the second period. He has got two goals. That trash should take over. Ryan the goal take over. We have no idea what's going on. I guess what you didn't see clearly. He got tired of it. I was going to tip it in. I was going to roll it in the pants. And that is still an intentional way. He took it in there. Two goals made for Michael Bunny. Now it's a 3 2 lead in the second with six minutes to go. Now the win for Carolina. Chaffield trying to have an answer in. Over to Bunny. Going for another take, and it's stopped by Bezilevsky. Great chance here as Bunny will have to regroup it in to extend 4 2. As the wind puts in for the Carolina, he blocks that shot as Drury pass broken up as Heppen gets again to Chaffee. Chaffee right toward the right wing, left wing. The spin across, has the shot, big save by Kuchikov. Ready it, Corino in! Chaffee shot, missed it off. That's another opportunity save by the goaltender. Ready is trying to get Stankos back in to tie this game again. Hammond blocks that shot. Great effort, take. And redirected, it goes out of play. Lots of time up in the period. Carolina entering it back. 3-2 game. Point tries to give over to Hedman. The backhander misses the target. Birds trying to pump it out of here. And Tara Biden has it begin to slam it. Over to Skachikov. Over to Ago, shot, stopped by Veselevsky. And he will try to cover a puck up for Veselevsky with 4.38 to go. Face off win for Ako. Redirected, points grab it back. Trying to attack it. Now it's Burns back to Slavin. Slavin over to Svetrikov. Streaking in his own. Up with the redeflected. For a chance take. One play break. Stopped again by Veselevsky. Oh, going to be too close out there. I thought Svetrikov got it really well to take over. Weaving that puck out. I think that skill up would have been almost kind of attempted. And that didn't really change at all. And back to point. Back to Hegel. Hegel with a chance to Kucherov. In the corner, Hegel finding Sorelli. Block the shot. Can't take the puck back. Jarvis has that puck. Now into the Carolina to the Tampa Bay zone. Here's Stahl. Shoots close save by Veselevsky. Just 3.14 left to go in the second period. Getting ready for another face-off. Now they're off to do it again. Face-off win for Saul. Staff to a battle attack, and this one goes right back to Jarvis' shot. Oh, that was a little too close to make the point blank range out of Smachikov, but that Kennedy didn't really have it in. That one stayed out. And now the faceoff comes on, 3-0-2 to go. Faceoff win, and a shot save puts it up. Hedman grabs that puck back, offered to Chaffee. Shoots a puck, and it's blocked up. Chaffee, and it's sketchy, takes it over. Jarvis takes that puck back. Moving in, Brady takes that puck away. Tampa Bay back in the offense zone. Shoot save by Kochikov. 2.22 left to go in the second period. Still looking to early that game for the lead to, er to end this one in the second period to even up. The win puts it in. Shoots it for redirection. That one stays out. And it's Natchez. Back to Drury. Giving it over to get the schedule. 
Sketchy right toward the right wing. Going for a shot. Leg in the range. This one stayed out. And stopped by Veselinski. Under two minutes remaining in the second period. Still got a great lead off for the Hurricanes. Now they're off to another face off. Got a clash moment here. Got to look for another take. Off to another win. And now it's Furbix back the other way. Kicks that puck out of here. And here's the Han. Right again to Hagel. Hagel spins it across. Find it again to Kucherov. Lost the effort. Shoots it saved by Kurchakov. Down to 90 seconds in the second period. Trying to have an answer take over in the lead. Now it's an our face off time. 3 2 to score. Face off with Drury and back to Petch. E. Over to Natchez. Natchez trying to roll that in toward the right wing. Tumble takedown. Furitz. Has it over again to try to fix another one to Kucherov. Kucherov over to Hegel. Hegel. Toward the middle of the man. Stop by Kucherov. Just only one minute left to remain in the second period in the second. Critical draw here between Carolina and Tampa Bay. And Paul wins the faceoff. Perfect to the Han shot. Redirected, and it goes back to Paul. Gives again to Perfect. Perfect to Chaffee. Shot missed again. Slab and trying to have it out. Again to Terravine. Terravine in. Shoots one for another pat save by Coach Clive Vazileski. Terramani gets again to Burns. Shot! Redirection! Take it out! Stopped again by the, by the goaltender. Just 20 seconds for the second period. Chaffee trying to tie the game. Crowd still disliking the way they played. Chaffee. Grabs the puck out. Corbix trying to get to Devon. And Stan goes to tie the game. This is why! Two periods to go, and it's down. Just one period left. Three, two, score. We'll be right back on the rest. Final period in PNC Arena of Raleigh, North Carolina. This is where it comes down to this. Well, I hope you enjoyed this part of the seventh game, but this is where it comes in to win, to move on to the conference finals. Have a little bit of a close call range. I send it over to you, Silverstone, of your take. Well, it happened with the Tampa Bay Lightning. They only scored once and a tie in the game, but Carolina, they had a lead off to take in. But this might be a closer way to get right to it. If they can answer it back, I assume that they will do their best. Auto uh, shot misses wide. And Evan will try to kick the puck out of here. Over to Kucherov. Again to point. Over to Radish. Again to Kucherov. Right toward the wing. And it's missed wide as Hagel tries to grab it over again to Kucherov. Pass broken up and back to Svechikov. Gaining zone for the left. Missed the shot. This one is off to Svechikov and back to Terravine. No deflection given here as Point tries to get enter it out. Pointing it down. Looking in. And a tie game, this one stayed out. Tara Reining grabbing the puck out of the zone. Looking in, save puts up by Vesilevsky. 18 16 left to go in the third. Trying to get Reyes back on the board. And now here's Stamkos. Bumps off the corner. Stamkos gives again to Burns. Burns off to Bunny. Bunny cutting down, stopped it away. And then he gives to Stamkos. Here's an iron take right toward the right wing. Lost the effort and it's now back the, again to Samkos. Broken the chain, Drury takes it off. Lost the puck. Fouling it out of here. Here's another one for the Lightning. Chappie over to Paul shot. Go for redirection has been knocked out. Paskey kicks again to Drury. Drury fires that puck around the net. And DeHaan's got there right away. Again to Barabola. 
and driving to center. Sketchy with the puck takeover. Saul trying to grab it out with a new line set change up. Landing off to Barrett Bullock. Furmix with the puck back to Glennoning. Fires it deep. Can't take that goal. A chance to tie it up. Big hit. A low moment on the blue line. Wow. Rocking down body is going to take a lot making effort. I don't say what you're going to do. You can't mess them up on them. If you're doing it again, I will make you pay it back. Oh, don't make him feel like you did. Never all. Houston Cobb, right toward the right wing. Going for a tie, he's redirected, and back to Terra And here's Ajo. Streaking right toward the left wing. Puck taken over by Monte. Here's Chappie. Shoots! Saved by Kuchikov. 15.36 to go in the third period. Still looking to get that close run in. Jacob Slavik is one of the better defensive effort. He really likes to take all this pressure in defense. The better take is, it calls a shutdown. It's a lot of make healthy moment, but that might be a little bit of a hard impact. They really need to get this one thing over and done quickly. Try to get it through here and we'll see if you can get that one shutting down. Take over here. Back to you. And also, Andre Vesikov has a lot of a better elite. He's looking to have his lacrosse move. That's why his skill up visibility has been picking it this way through. He likes to have that lacrosse move. He can go over or right from the side in between of the net. I'll try to find out two players in between for a great look of Petrangelo for Jacob Slavon and, of course, Andre Svechikov. Based over the air, here's Sarah Vining with under 15 minutes to remain in the third. Svechikov shot. Big step of the play. Turbine and trying to grab it out of here. Sanchikov again to Slavin. And a pass, backing over. Misses the chance opportunity. Slavin again to Svechikov again. The shot's blocked and it goes right toward the wall. Now trying to find the airway to Slavin and shot. Same play. Big with a play, gonna move. And it's back to Cernax again to Azamount. Third time, misses the shot as another stop by Kochakov. Burns trying to give over to get a Drury. Rock the body down! Bulwark again to Cerna. Natchez with the puck with only 13.45 to go in the third. Here's Buddy right toward his way down. Over to Drury. Cerna again to Hegel. Here they come right toward the center point. Give it in and go! This one's fucked out. Natchez, over to get into Slavin. And here's Bunny again, trying to get over right to the other side of it to Drury. Misses the effort, and that one gets an easy save by the goaltender. So we're going to get a Hegel. Trying to release the puck out. Jarvis with the buck seal. Solid play. Bunny shot, stopped by Veselevsky. 12.56 left to remain in the third period. Trying to get right into work. And it's now Hurricanes and Lightning. Trying to have another total shots on goal with under 13 minutes. And it's another win for Point. Hedman tries to have it over right toward the other side of his own. And here's Hegel. Hegel just got your call shot. Kucherov shot. Stopped again by the goaltender. Right here. Spider save. Off the glass and it's broken up out here. Uh, gonna have to replace it over in the middle. Right above the net. That's gonna be an ouch. Steinman Stumpkus. The better way to play is for his confident ability. One time after it gets it going. That's why he has to bring all of his ability on a one time motion. He might have it another week. We have to take her over into a spot of his own. But that might keep it from it out of his own if he has that coming in. His wired up shot was saved by Veselovsky. They're in a midway market of period, still a 3 2 game. Now we're off to our next face off. Still lots of time left in the period zone. Carolina up ahead by one. Wow, that's a special shot. Kariba misses a shot. Redirected off, and now Chaffee takes the effort. 
call back the airway to Stamkos. Stamkos fires that puck. And Skeggy kicking the puck back the airway. Paul trying to give over. Stamkos lost the effort. Skeggy trying to get that puck out. Jarvis backs it over again to Martina. 11.40 to go in the third period. He fires it again. Misses wide. Right behind the net and back to Mote. And Barrett Bullet will have it again in Radius. Radius with that one over again to Mote. Solid save here. Skeggy. Valley the puck around the board and Spectrocroft will have it out of the airway. 2 to left wing, fighting Terrabine. The rebound put up by Skeggy. Ago give to Burns, shot, gloved it up by Veselevsky. Near the midway mark of the period. They don't see what Veselevsky really does, but that matters happen. They don't really get that one keep going. And Glennoning wins the faceoff. Here's the Han again to Glennoning. Now pass again to Barrett Bullock. Toward the middle, Freddie Glennoning. Stop the pad here. The Hurricanes are back in the offense. Kick the puck out of the zone. And now it's the Han grabbing the puck rebound again to Glennoning. Off to Mote. We direct it off the skate of a stick and Svechikov back the other way again to Terravainen. Toward the corner, Mote takes the puck away. And the Han has it now. Pass the midway mark of the period in the third. Off the face mask and slot him with a rebound. That's going to be a hard one to take in there. I think it must have happened when Mote Smith can't really make the recall out of it. And shot stole! Michael Barney! 30 goals in the hat trick game in game seven. Now the hat comes on a ring, celebrating the time. for his next playoff inbound to meet, reach the next level in the conference finals. And that's who that this keeps it going. Point shot stopped again by Kuchikov. And Slavin has it again to Natchez. Tour to left wing. Shoot! Save by Veselovsky. 9-12 to go in the second period, third period. Still trying to get an answer score for another take. Still a lot of time left in the period. Hurricanes up it to extend by two with 9.12 to go. And as the number win puts it up, here's Burns over to Slavin. Redirected, and it's off again by Vasilevsky. Point finds Kucherov. And it's Hedman with the puck. Gives again to Hagel. Hagel over to point for the blank in the range, and it's another main here by his goaltender. Holding on is Burns. Gives it over to Slavin. Taken along by Drury. 8 3 left to remain in the third period. Shoots! Oh, a big stop by Vasilevsky. How did he hold on to it now? You know, they were saying that Vasilevsky, that one really has to keep that one in there going. Drury with the puck takeover. And here's Pesky again to Jarvis. Jarvis over to Drury. Redirected off. Drury trying to give over, and Reyes with the puck steal, back to Stamkos. Reyes in the slot, loses the effort. Martin Hook again to Slavin. Across the line, looking for a chance for a score, and it's over back to Chappie. Chappie, loose the puck. Kevin takes it over. Over now to Stamkos, back to Chappie. Chaffee fires it, the blocker stopped made by Kochikov. Evans spins it across. 
the pass back to Paul. Again to Radius. Here's Stamkos. Shoots it and a step made. Jarvis tries to roll it over. Racing inbound right toward the right wing and the left. Evan takes the puck over. And now he tries to roll it out in to the wing. Back to Paul. And a shot's blocked by Pesky. Off to Stahl. Stahl right toward the left wing, get the game to Jarvis. Jarvis blocks a shot. And that goes with Victor Edmund with a rumble takedown. Back to Glennon. 6.15 left to go in the third period. Trying to give it over again as he makes a number hit down. Back to Svetchikov. Fans are still loving it. Dion's got that puck. Now tries to center attack it, and Akko put the puck steal again to Svechikov. And a stop made, this one stays out. Fires that puck out. The Hurricanes are back in to take another zone ahead. Pesky, right toward the center. The pass to Terravine. No sailing call as the Hodge tries to live it out. Pesky open shot. Misses the target wide. Sitchka back again to Akko. Fires it. Pat saved by Vizileski. He denied that play. That is really what they did. I know Vizileski really must have that one coming in. And it seemed like it's a little bit of a travel stack here. Sitchka. Watching Perfects. Hegel to Degon. Barry Bullet. For redirection to Hegel. And it's off the stick. Back to Glennon. Back to Degon again to Hegel. Pat save. Glennon with the puck again to Hegel. Trying to get it out. And he's on the battling for the puck rebound. Hegel. Spins across. And it's now back to Perfects. Shoots. It's missed again. Carolina back the air away. Abo taking his time. Loses the puck after. Point gives again a giggle. And now he has it again to Kucherov again to Point. Point shot left saved by Kucherov. Jury in the left wing. Big smack down here. Back to Perwitz. Again to Paul. Paul letting it go down. Shot glove safe. Coach Ekos going to hold that whistle in. 3-3-3 to go in the third. Now they're off to an air face off. Their better team is for Carolina as they're looking to get back into conference finals for the second time. 4-2. Stahl wins the face off. Track field again to Martin. Out of the penalty stop in the signal. On to Tampa Bay. They're getting an extra skater on. Yeah, this is not always going to turn out great. That because of the interference? That's going to change it over quickly. Not a great way to do it. Power play coming on for Carolina Hurricanes. Under nearing a three minute mark in the third. Still a 4-2. And a win puts it in for the current Canes. Current Canes fighting Tara Vinen and Svechikov. Shoots! Stopped by Veselevsky. Tara Vinen rebounding again to Svechikov. Fires it! Up and goes right toward the wall. Serenak again to Isamal. Unable to clear the puck. Now he will clear the puck in the center zone. And it's off the ball. Ball shot, glove save. What a takeover for a Carolina Hurricane goaltender defender. Goes it off to Tara Vinen. And it's back, back again to Svechikov again and goes in. Goes it shot. Off again. Backing over is Burns. Burns to Tara Vinen. Blocked the shot. Drury. Over to Burns. Going for an take. This one's out of here. Cernax. Can't hold on to the puck. Nose in, trying to get that one out. To regroup the putt. Off again by Victor Redman. And Svechikov has it across. And here's Burns, fires a shot, but a rebound, no power play made. 
Cernax has it across right toward the Arizona. For a short bandit. And our big save here by Kochikov. And here's Buddy with 20 seconds for a Carolina power play. Glennon racing toward in his wing. Looks like his time's almost about to expire. Kochikov's going to sell that puck with 116 to go in the third period. Let's see who had a better call as I send it over to Wood Spoonie. Sebastian Ajo has been really doing the better ways to pick it up. I was really hoping that he would do more than that, but I think the conference finals is going to be a lot of challenging raid. That's going to keep on coming in to go for it again. Stopped again. As Glennie will try to get that puck inbound with one minute to go. Here's Bunny. Back to Ago. Man advantage. And Ago will win it. And you did. Hurricane is going back to the conference finals for the second time. You know, it is your way. You can just definitely snipe it out. And that's about to not help. Maybe the team to rebound. Look at the crowd. They're starting to fire on TNT. And here's the arena. They're ready to move on to the conference finals. The second time of the franchise season. And Eagle gives again a point. Fire the shot. Missed again. Ago trying to read it out. Back at Svetchikov with 35 seconds. Over behind Taravainen. Missed the target off. And deflection back to Peshki. Here's Taravainen. Can't hold on to it now as Sketchy has it over now to Ako. Ako is in bad. Oh, big hit, a low moment. Down to 10 seconds for the Tampa Bay. Spins across. Last chance. And Coach Akot stops that puck. Well, it seems like the day is over. Tampa Bay Lightning, another Florida team, is eliminated. And speaking of this one for Tampa Bay out of here, the next game is up as we have the Tampa, Toronto Maple Leafs and the Bruins that's going to be coming up right after this concluded game. And that will do it. Carolina Hurricanes going back to the conference finals. Eliminates the Florida team. Well, you all know from Coach Clark, they're bringing that team to a celebration today. They really have to be incredible. Incredible team. They're ready to be on the lookout. And it's been a wild night. So long, Tampa Bay. Cut boom. What do you know, Kaboom? <laughs> you wouldn't take that many Willy Woods. And that's your sellings over here. So a beast along with Silver Spoon and Wood Spoonie. Thanks for joining us for this game. And we'll see you all again for our next game of the Stanley Cup playoffs. Take care. Peace out. Alright, thank you so much. Time for three star players in the game. Andre Vizalevsky with the 67 saves of the third star of the night. Second star goes to Carolina Michael Bowie with three goals, two assists, and eight hits. Had a perfect crowd timing with his hat trick on a rebound. And he had it all with the crowd winning favor. And the first star goes to Faraday Kochikov with 77 saves of the game. He has been doing his terrific ability. The better score if it happens to be what they usually take is, and you know how to happen is you really gotta play honor and respecting what they're and they really need to do, do their better favors to have that chance in. That's what they all do. Keep on scoring, keep on attacking, let them do what they did. And here's how they do it at close to distance. 79 over 72, Tampa Bay total shots of goal. Then 69 over 63 for Tampa Bay tips. 701 over 632, time on attack for Tampa Bay Lightning. 94 over 90 for a passing of Carolina. 34 over 27 for Carolina on a faceoff wins. And two minute penalty kill. And it's another one with a fighting call. Five minute penalty kill for Carolina. And seven minute penalty kill for Tampa Bay. No power play goal. Just two minutes and a power play minutes. Well, I guess that's it for now. So long Tampa Bay Lightning. And we'll hope to see them again next season. And on the other side, Carolina Hurricanes are waiting for someone else to win this game. That will be the Bruins or the Maple Leafs. That's going to be coming up on the other side in just a bit. So if you're tuning in, we'll get your next game coming up underway. In the meantime, if you're not watching, I hope you all enjoy this game. 
we'll see how this one goes. Peace out, folks, for a while as the NHL Stanley Cup playoffs on EA Sports. Hope everybody has a great afternoon, and hopefully we'll get to a 5.30 game just a bit. Stick around later. More to come after this. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.